See, this is this is where we could take get get ours to. That's basically. If you come back to our channel in about a year, two years time, we could be halfway there. Yeah, we're just admiring. Is, admiring is this yours? Car? Yeah. It's a beast, a little beast. Yeah, she's good, yeah. We've just picked up a cup ourselves. This is our first track, though. We're, oh, the, we're the slow cup out on track. Okay, <laughs> but with the original interior trim, yeah. everything. Yeah, yeah, literally. Not original wheels, though. No. Okay, but that's how I started. Well, it started <laughs> off like yours, you know, so... Um, Probably on speed five, it's a cup. Um, it's but a look at that. Two cup. Yeah. Mark this fish. is a turbo, is it? Uh, supercharged. Supercharged, yeah. Right. So, um, which is really nice, guys. What sort of horsepower do you reckon it's? 240. Well, you'll start off with, I can't remember, you know what, this has been such a long project. The seats, right? That's you probably will probably, one. well, the first thing I've done is tyres. Yeah. So you get yourself a set of, you know, track day tyres and you're thinking, whoa, man, this is amazing because you're not drifting anymore, right? <laughs> yeah. And then because you've got the grip, because of the tyres, you're drifting in those seats. <laughs> you end up you can't steer the car. So you just shift the problem. <laughs> yeah, so that's what happens. And then, excuse the language, you're fucked because then from there on, that is it, there's no Money. return. Yeah. So yeah, so what happens is you start off with some tyres and you get the grip that you want. And because you've got the grip, you're sliding all over your interior, right? So you can't steer the car. So probably the next thing that'll come, I should have a garage. Woody, I should have a garage, you know. You should that. have a garage. I should have, it should be a mechanic. Anyway, so you'll get yourself a couple of bucket seats. Yep. And then... They look like nice ones, to be fair. Yeah, Recaro's, and then Mark Fish. I've got these best oak. Um, these seat mounts are made by Mark Fish Motorsport. He's um, he's a rental specialist, if you've mm -hmm. heard of him. Yep. He's been around for like 40 years. So he, stuff, yeah. he, he has manufactured these seat mounts, so you can see they're like neat, and then onto them you drop your bucket seat. So anyway, so really, two get yourselves two bucket seats, the steering wheel. get the seat mounts, get a steering wheel, track day tyres, and then obviously with these seats is going to come the harnesses, right? Yeah. And then you use a cage. Okay. <laughs> well, you don't, because you can do the harnesses, you can pick up off the back of the body, right? Um, so really, if it was my car, here we go, I would do the tyres, the seats, the seat mounts, the harnesses, and then you've got to do your brakes, yeah? Oh, it, these brakes, I only put these on a, uh, last year. I was running on the original, what are they called, carbon, no, not carbon, um, Brembo HC yeah. H something discs, right? Yeah. With the original calipers and just a good pad, a good padded pad or whatever. RS29 or something like that. Yeah, not, I started off from the Prado 2500s and then we went more aggressive. Okay. So, brakes, and then get some cooling done. Mark Fish has these little aluminium fins that you can get to keep your... So lose, lose the fog's hair. We'll let the internet have a look. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's not scientific. So there's a couple of alley mounts or shields in there and it just directs the cold air to the brakes. But I only upgraded to these like last year. These are four grand. Breaks, Jesus. Three grand plus lines plus fit in. It was just under four grand. All right, we are. Anyway, Original suspension? Suspension? No, 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 no. You no, know, obviously you're not. But is, is it any good or not? <laughs> what, the original? I yeah. can't remember. I think, you know. <laughs> so, no, so many mods <laughs> later. So then you're going to get body roll. So the next thing. So this is what I'm saying. You, you know, once you start, there's no, no return stopping. because every mod you do, you'll notice it and go, wow. Yeah. And then it puts the problem somewhere else, somewhere else in the car, <laughs> which is all good. But that's a good way of doing it. Yeah. You, the good thing about doing all that is you appreciate mm. each and every mod. Yeah. And then you learn, you kind of think, and I've got too much body roll. So you then thought the suspension and then you think, well, I need some safety and the roll can before you know it, you know. Yeah, then you've so then where do you it. go next? You, you're here right, now. So where, then, where? Right, so then, you know, you want more power, so then you go supercharged. <laughs> and then you think, well, I want to brake quicker and better, and then you upgrade the brakes even more. And then, really, drive the train. Get somebody like me. I go out, and then you go out with Jess, because she races, and then you realise that, you know, you get some driver training, so that I'm at the stage where, leave the car alone, yep. you need some driving training. Yep. And that's what I'm doing with Jess realize how far off we are yeah. capable the car is. how capable yeah. the car is right so i'm driving it 50 percent and there's another 50 more of what you can do but you need to go to someone who you races know, okay. yeah and dresses that person it's very good penny. you must be a lot of money into this then oh yeah then i ask 30 grand i think wow yeah, but over a period of time yeah but you know it's great it's a great toy 
and you know, in, in the right hands, it does destroy the exotic, which is great. The, the, the thing that's made me feel slightly better is the fact that on the straights, it wasn't like, shit, we are so slow compared to him. It's because you've got a bloody supercharger. Yeah. <laughs> that's what I was thinking. Like, how am I not able to just keep up on the straights yes, here? Yes, as well, because she's carrying so much speed through the corners. Oh yeah, yeah. No, your corners. Are, hands down, I'll admit, I'm not never going to get yeah. anywhere near. But this it's good fun. Thing, but you bought one of the best cars for yeah. track days. What did you pay for it? If you don't mind me asking. Eight hundred fifty quid. Eight hundred and fifty quid. Yeah. For a one seven two cup. Cup. Yeah. Eight hundred and fifty quid. We've changed the wheels, but that's it. Yeah. We spent about a thousand. It's about a thousand pounds in the What have you done the on the brakes? Have you put some pads? Oh, we've got braided hoses and AP. No, you put different yet. fluid, right? Got yeah. Eight changed, different yeah. fluid. Braided hoses and racing fluid. And racing fluid, so you don't. The pads are only just standard pads. Standard pads. Well, get. Some decent pads in there. Yeah. And, and tyres uh, are thinking next. When we they're just on Toyo T on ice, which is okay, just a we'll shit road tyre. Yeah, get some Toyo R Triple Eight R's or the Dunlop die resers if you want to film these. These are about hundred and something pound each, hundred and ten. So You've they're Dun well, Dunlop, yeah, die reser. D three G's or o, I think they're D three G's. Um, but you feel you feel the heat in those. I mean, they stick like. Yeah. Go on, put your hand in. Go on, hold it on there. <laughs> I don't want it. Right. I yeah, can cook on that. Right. So, <laughs> those yokies, then. You don't yeah. recommend the yokies? No, they're, they're they're my road going tires, guys. They're oh, really right. Good. So that's what yeah. we were thinking of. Your they're road going now. tires are also track tires. Yeah, they're <laughs> road going tires that you can use them on track, but you know, compared to these, Not, yeah. it's chalk and cheese. Yeah, yeah. Right? yeah. Chalk and cheese. Yeah, you can't compare the two. Standard rear brake. Standard, yeah, because they do virtually nothing. Yeah. Unfortunately, the little ouch, my nephew put it into a tyre wall for me at, um, at Bedford Auto Drum Circuit, which is a great circuit. Yeah, we this, were, is a, this is an awkward circuit, guys. Yeah, we were, we were, we were tossing we were up between yeah, Bedford, Bedford and here. Bedford Auto Drum GT Circuit has got to be an, it's an awesome circuit for the Clio's, and you have loads of runoff space. And there was nothing to hit, there's nothing to hit other than this tyre wall. <laughs> and he Mind the tyre wall, right? Yeah. But um, yeah, no, overall, yeah, it's an expensive toy, but you know, no regrets. No. Good. No, if I could do it again, I would buy an out and out cup race car. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, and, you know, because it comes with a sequential gearbox and da, 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 if I could have, you know, it's been, a, it's been an enjoyable journey. Well, what have you done with your shifter here? Uh, that, right, that looks like, that is from a company, I think they're called Pure Motorsport, I can find out for you. But all it is, because it looks like a race gear box, Yeah, yeah, right? that's what I was thinking. Yeah, it's all show. Uh, all it is is just... Uh, standard box, extended, standard gearbox, extended, um, uh, you know, gear lever and the linkages underneath you they get rid of all the plastic and it's all metal ball rolls joint okay. so it tightens up the gearbox yeah. tightens up your gear selection okay. cheap mod great mod oh, that's what we like is your gearbox all right then is you, you understand the gearbox then yes but it's got a gripper diff built into it oh, which was right. another three and a half grand yeah, yeah, hell. so the gripper diff that's making a lot of difference yeah. yeah because as you're without it as you're putting the power down you know the, it's spinning the wheels whereas this the gripper just deals with it but that's another three you know it's a big job yeah, yeah. so yeah so it's a well sorted car um, Mate, it looks epic and it's going like it shit off a shovel. Sounds it, sounds it, sounds it, sounds right. it sounds good, right? When I was out listening to it, and second best, I'd say, that's yes. the CSL. The, C the CSL is. <laughs> but it does sound good. This is, yeah. yeah it sounds we good. said, didn't we? Hey, second car. Clear, second yeah. car. No, this, honestly, no. It's, it's, yeah. it's steady on the pit wall here. Yeah. Flying past, this is the second best sounding car out there. Wait, what other cars here? There's M3 CSL. Oh, the M3, the, M3. the M3. Yeah, I was going to get one of those years ago. I regret not getting one. I've about. got one of them as well. That's my, that's my road car. What, the CSL? The CSL. No, no. Just... <laughs> Let's go.